Hey, what's up guys? I'm back with another episode of Generative Art with TypeScript. In last week's video, we created art with randomly moving particles. If you haven't seen that, there's a link in the description. This week, we are going to improve it by setting an image and letting it influence the drawing. Here's a sneak peek of what we will create. More examples towards the end of the video. If you like what I create, please subscribe and like the video. First we will refactor our code by extracting the drawing function. Now we will create an image canvas and give the context. We draw the image inside the onload callback. This makes sure that image is loaded before we draw it. For the images to load on the web page, we have to serve HTML from a web server. Now we will randomly load an image to the canvas and pass the context to each particle. Image data structure contains pixel values. We're going to use Luma of the image to use in our drawing.
Luma is the relative brightness of each pixel. Now we need to make sure our values for X and Y are in the range before accessing the pixel values. Clamp function achieves this. Now, we will make use of Luma values at each X and Y positions. The velocity of particle and its size will depend on the LN value. We're going to make the particles reset after some time. This can be achieved by setting the time to live value. Now we will set the alpha value of the particle when we draw.
gives a nice softer look. That's all the parameters we can manipulate. Let's have a look at the result. If you like what I create, please subscribe and like the video.